Hello everyone and welcome to another screencast on the Unidata Integrated Data Viewer. So we have a user that wants to back out some flow vectors from wave directions. So in order to do that, the way that you achieve that in the IDV is you write a little Jython function slash formula. So we're going to go ahead and do that. But first, we need to load up some data. So let's go to our dashboard and go to our data chooser tab and go to our catalogs node and dig under NCEP wave watch data and we're just going to load up some wave data from the eastern United States latest is fine we're going to add that as a data source and we're going to look at the fields here for just a moment so under this 2D grid, we have some wave data, and in particular, we have directions of the well, uh, wave swells. So we are going to write a formula to back out the flow vectors from those directions. So the way that you do that in the IDV is you go to the formulas right here in the under data sources and right click and you can edit the Jython library. Now, I've already written the formula to back out the flow vectors from, uh, from the direction, so I'm just going to copy and paste that. Okay, and then there's just a little bit of trigonometry going on here in order to display the vectors, and we're going to use this built-in function that's already available to you in the IDV. So we're going to save that. And the next thing we need to do is write a formula that refers to that function. So this is a little bit of a confusing part. There's an extra level of indirection that you have to take into account. So you define the, the Jython function. Now you need to write a formula that refers to that function. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And we're just going to reuse the same name by giving it the same description, same name, and we need to refer to that Jython function that we just defined. Okay, and so I'm just going to copy and paste that. And we're going to add the formula. Okay, great. So now the formula is available to us and we can use it. So we are going to create a display of flow vectors and so we're going to choose the flow vector as a, f a function as a field or formula as a field and we're going to go under flow displays right here in the in the displays panel and we're going to choose vector plan view and we are going to create a display. Now it's prompting us for the field that we need to plug into that formula and in this case it's simply the wave direction so I'm gonna go ahead and find that and it's available here and we're just gonna choose one time and we're gonna click OK so now we have our flow vectors but unfortunately they're way too dense so we're going to fix that problem by clicking on the legend here and we're going to only display every fifth vector. That should declutter it quite a bit. So we'll change this from 0 to 5, press return, and note that we have our flow vectors that are quite a bit more visible than they were before. So that's how you create a formula in the IDV, a Jython slash Python formula. I hope that this has been a useful screencast. Thank you and see you next time. For more information about the IDV or Unidata, please visit us at www.unidata.upar.edu. If you have questions, comments, or suggestions about future screencast topics, please contact us at support-idv at unidata.upar.edu.